how many people who have no other morbidities under the age of 60 have died from this illness? Who have no other morbidities? Yeah. Because I can tell you how many people under 65 have died. And obviously under some of those 60, with other morbidities, no other morbidities may well have survived. A morbidity doesn't mean you're... 350. You're more likely to drown. The 400 people a year that drown, right? So I think we have to get things a bit in context. What, what comfort would that offer to the families of those who've lost Every loved death is tragic. But believe me, we are entering, we're already in, the largest recession for 300 years. In fact, it's not just one recession. The Bank of England have said the, the economy will shrink by 14%. That's the equivalent of two recessions. It's a depression. And I wouldn't be surprised if we have two million more unemployed people within a year. Imagine the agony of two million more unemployed people. How many deaths might flow from that? How many deaths are flowing from the fact that we've got half as many A&E appointments at the moment. Cancer patients not being seen, people with heart disease not being seen. And the collateral damage of this uh, campaign of fear and lockdown has to be taken into account. Very soon, I believe, lockdown will be causing more deaths than the virus. 